see that buggy over there, the one with the tires like Barry Bonds' biceps? Behind the wheel is Rob Steffi. On weekends, this Pittsburgh cop mocks the laws of gravity, driving in America's latest motorsport craze, rock crawling. It's part NASCAR, part demolition derby, and when the rock goes straight up or straight down, gravity frowns on driver error. I'm shocked myself at some of the climbs I've actually made, saying, how did I do that? A good spotter helps avoid hitting the cones and losing points, and lowest score wins. Competitors compare a rock crawl to a roller coaster. Except you're the one driving the roller coaster, and you're the one decides whether it stays on the track or it doesn't. And often, it doesn't. It's daring, it's dangerous, and it's exciting. One reason it's so successful, fans get so close they could smell the mayhem. One redneck told of another redneck, and then 10 more people came out. We try to send them up obstacles that most, you, most of us, even healthy and young and dumb, can't climb on foot and hand. As Rob Steffi learned, many climbs require a certain hard-headed perseverance. This was Steffi's view of the rollover from inside his buggy. He was dazed, but fine. A hit is what the sport has become in this battle of man versus mountain.